everyone and welcome to this new video. So today I'm going to talk about my 2016 favorites because believe it or not 2016 is almost over which is crazy but 2016 has been one of the best years and one of the worst years but it's been fun. So today I'm going to talk about all of my favorite things of 2016 and I'm also going to include some of my least favorite things like the dab. I hate when people dab like what the don't forget to give this video a thumbs up i will really appreciate it and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel i post new videos a lot and i'm so excited for 2017 because you'll get a lot of videos from me so don't forget to subscribe and be a part of the fam and be my friend and we can be friends and hang out and have fun so yeah be sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and also let me know down below in the comments your favorite thing of 2016 and one of your least favorite things about 2016 because you know <gasps> there are probably a lot. So with that being said, let's get into the video. The first thing that I absolutely loved in 2016, off the shoulder tops. Bay, bay, baby, but I've never worn it. Baby, bay. I wore this to my first party. It was a great time. But yeah, as I said, off the shoulder tops. Love them. Best thing that ever happened to me. Thank you, 2016. Thank you. <laughs> My next 2016 favorite has been this mascara. I love this mascara so, so, so much. It's so great. I discovered it when I was just like, I need a cruelty-free mascara. So I was just looking at this and I was like, I need it. So I got it. And it's the best mascara ever. It's called Lash Domination by Bare Minerals. I've been talking about it a lot, but it doesn't get enough. Like, no one knows about this. And my next favorite must be the dog filter. I can't even explain how much I love the dog filter. I mean, without the dog filter, I wouldn't have a boyfriend right now. <laughs> Just kidding. But honestly, the dog filter makes everything look prettier. Like, you look so much better with the dog filter. I love it. My next favorite thing has been this bralette. I bought it this fall. It's still one of my favorites this year because I've been wearing it all the time. It's so nice. It's so comfortable and my boobs look really nice in it. Next favorite thing ever. Fairy lights. Babies, it's okay. I'll just put you down for a while. You're in my video. You'll be famous. Fairy lights is one of the prettiest things Ever. I love fairy lights and this year I've just been <laughs> a little bit too obsessed <laughs> so yeah I love fairy lights and they are so nice and I love them and they're really cute I'll just you know be a little bit festive Anyway, I got this sweater in late December of 2015 and ever since then I've been obsessed. You know how much I love this. It's iconic. I mean, I used to wear this in every single one of my videos and people even got tired of it, which I don't really understand. But I mean, it's beautiful. My next favorite thing has been coconut milk. If you haven't tried coconut milk, try some coconut milk because it's sweet, it's refreshing, it's nice, it's nutty, it's so so I love coconut milk, so I definitely recommend coconut milk. So my favorite app this year must be Tumblr. I've been so obsessed with Tumblr recently, um, or like this entire year I've been, oh my god, like Tumblr has been my bae. That's so stupid to say, but Tumblr is my baby. I love Tumblr, and especially when you guys ask me questions because I love to reply to you. I don't always do it because I'm not in the mood, but I try to. So if you want to ask me questions, I always have a link to my Tumblr down below in the description box. But yeah, if you want to follow me on Tumblr and check out what I reblog, <laughs> you can check out my Tumblr. The After Books. So this summer I was reading The After Books um, by Anna Todd. It's like a One Direction fan fiction, but you don't really think about that. Um, but it's a really nice book. Lots of sex, really nice. So yeah, I read that in the summer and ever since then I just but thinking about it all the time. So it's really good. It's really easy to read too. It's not a deep book, so you don't have to think anything when you read it. You're just like, oh, nice. Whenever you're reading it, you're just sitting there like, nice. And that's everything I've been liking for 2017. I mean, 2016. 2016 has been a pretty good year for me, actually. Um, I quite enjoyed it. Um, it's been it's been great. Someone asked me if I could do like a what happened during 2016, like the good, the bad, and why not? Let's do like a quick recap. 
a few things that happened to me 2016. I threw a birthday party, <laughs> it was really nice. I did a condom challenge with a few of my friends and it was nice. I got into a relationship, it was really nice. We broke up, it was really nice. Honestly, I was really sad when I broke up with my boyfriend, but it was now I can say that it was a really great decision because after I broke up with him, everything just fell into place. I found myself, I really got to know myself. I spent like two weeks all by myself in my room. It was such a nice time, I vlogged it and no I didn't. I made so many YouTube videos and it was just the best time ever. And I also went to Thailand this summer. It was also nice. Then on the third day of school, my boyfriend and I, we started seeing each other again because we realized we loved each other. We couldn't be without each other. So we started seeing each other again and that brings me to now. I've just had a great time. That was a quick recap. 2016. You rocked, but you also sucked. That is going to be it for my video today. I really hope you liked it. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and let me know down below in the comments the good and the bads of 2016 for you. Like your most favorite thing and your least favorite thing. My favorite thing has to be the kill sweater or all of these things. And my least favorite thing, the dab. Please just stop dabbing. It's not, it's not, it's not. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It will make me so super duper happy. And with that be what? I'll see you in my next video. Bye.